Dear students, gate aspirants, I am Charles Leo. I am from M Sigma Gogulam. Today we are having a podcast in the backdrop of the launch, official launch of the gate 2025 website from IIT Roorkee. So for mechanical engineering aspirants, gate aspirants, today we are fortunate to have one of the leading experts, one of the best gate faculty in the entire country, Mr. Shagar sir. Hi. <laughs> so he will be sharing us. So what are the changes? Is there any changes at all? And whether there is any new strategies to be adopted uh, to score a good rank in GATE uh, 2025 for mechanical department. So let's start. So our first question is, uh, sir, have we gone through the website? Yes, you sir. Yes, sir. I've, I've seen the syllabus. I've okay. gone through the website. Okay. So yeah. students might be very interested, yeah. very curious to know whether yeah. there is any change in the yeah. syllabus, whether yes. there is any addition exactly. uh, topics or uh, yeah. whether in the, in the mechanical department. Yeah. As such, as I have gone through the website, absolutely there is no change in the gate syllabus of mechanical. Okay. It is a just like a cut paste, okay. cut paste okay. of gate 2024, same thing as repeated word to word, no change. In fact, this has been happening uh, since uh, gate 2021, 21. which was conducted by IIT Bombay. Okay. For the last 3-4 uh, years, there is absolutely there is no change. Mm. And the second thing, uh, second uh, thing generally students might be interested in knowing is gate. Is there any change in the gate pattern? pattern yes, yes. Uh, so actually, absolutely, there is no change in the gate pattern. Also, same 65 questions, mm -hmm. 100 marks, and three hours of time. As such, nothing has changed. Okay. And uh, that 65 questions also will contain around 30 one mark question mm -hmm. and uh, 35, 35 two, two, mark, two mark questions, questions mm -hmm. as such. And again, in that 65 questions, the type 15 questions. marks will be aptitude. 15 marks will be general aptitude, and including, and, uh, English. including English. And 13 marks will be mathematics. mathematics. Usually earlier, there was some range for the mathematics, but this time they have fixed it. They, fixed they have them. fixed it for 13 marks for the mathematics, okay, okay. specifically fixed. Mm -hmm. And 15 marks for the general aptitude and 72 marks for the core, core, paper. Uh, core paper, core engineering paper. If in our case, it is a core mechanical paper. Same pattern, same uh, type of things. But here, the questions have got MCQs, MSQs and NAT type. In the, uh, particularly, uh, this MCQ questions have got the negative marking. That yes, is one yes, important yes. thing we have to so notice. 1 by 3 for uh, one, one, by three for one mark and, and 2, two by, by 3 for the two, two mark questions. So many people, many students will be tempted to go for the uh, choice. So, don't do that. Unless otherwise you are sure about the answer, never attempt the negative, uh, negative marking of MCQ. Only when you are sure about the answer, go to the uh, MCQ actually. Because law of probability applies here. Mostly you will you'll go wrong if you take the choice and then finally you will end up the, already you earned some marks that will go wash, wash the way in the negative marking. So, don't attempt the negative marking. As far as the uh, NAT and MSQ questions, and uh, there is one precaution about the NAT. You say, for example, you got an answer of 25.356. Mostly, they are, while uh, putting the answer, they will write only 25.3. But uh, it will be taken as a wrong answer. You have to give at least uh, two digits after the decimal. Then only you will be awarded the full marks. I think in okay. the question, they will be specifying uh, the yes, number yes, of decimals. Yes, exactly. Number of decimals they will mention, even otherwise also. Even if they don't mention also, it is better to give two digits after the decimal also uh, so uh, you, one must be very careful to you know substitute the right units yes because exactly it could be in kpa or mega pascal uh, yeah exactly uh, exactly we have to what units supposing if you are getting the answer in pascal mm -hmm. answer may be asked in kilopascal yes, yes. so what is the units of the answer he is asking one nothing yes. say for example efficiency will be asked sometimes you will be asking as a percentage sometimes you will be asking asking as, as a, a fraction fraction yes, yes. as such so that particular thing we have to be carefully watch in the paper what what is the final he has asked so that kind of a care we must be very much uh, consider while putting the final answer and regarding the msq generally multiple selective questions were being uh, uh, that type of questions were being added only for the last three or four years okay i mean the, so in the msq unless otherwise uh, all the options whatever the correct options are there we have to unless you put all of the correct options you will not be given the full yes. mark no, no partial marking there. Suppose the three options are correct. Only two options you are given. You will not be given a partial marking. Yes, if uh, a, 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 B, C are all correct, 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 then correct, then correct, only you have to mark A, B and C. A, B and C. No uh, marks for uh, a, marking uh, A or uh, B, 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 B partial. Partial, partial. partial. partial marking, uh, they will not be okay. uh, giving for the MSQ. MSQ yes. But uh, what I observed is number of MSQ questions are asking ma maximum one or two. Sometimes, in I think gate 2022, they have not asked any MSQ. Mm -hmm. Uh, though MSQ questions are there, there are few as such, maybe two or three questions only they are coming. Mostly uh, that NEAT type and uh, multiple choice questions only. 
So that is what uh, uh, what we observed in the previous papers. Also. A point of relief for the students will be MSQs and the NAT won't be having any negative marks. Negative marks. That's so, so they, they can, care whatever the chance, whatever the luck you are. They, they can luck, confidently attend. Uh, uh, like any luck you may try in the MSQ and uh, NAT. As such. Yes. Mm -hmm. So there is no change in the pattern. Yes, no absolutely. change in the syllabus. No so change so, so the that's that's also another relief for the students, I think. And the exam dates also slightly. Uh, it is this time it is February first to 9th. Okay. Slightly before last time I think it was conducted a bit late. Okay. Now it is one first February, first to February 9th. Okay. Mm. So we can we, there is no need to expect any mm. surprises. So no, so no need to actually. Yeah, yeah, same, same flow. Yes, same flow. Yes, yes, yes. So uh, we have I think roughly 6.5 months ahead mm -hmm. uh, to, uh, for the gate exam. So students might be interested to mm. know uh, mm. which type of strategy would be suiting right now because mm. When they are going to search online, mm. they will find a plethora of mm. strategies, <laughs> being many institutes claiming yeah. this is the right strategy and it will yeah. be in complete contrast with someone else mm. discussing the similar uh, mm. strategies. So, uh, how to get the right strategies, oh, yeah. where to find the you know right platform. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, thank you. Actually, the main thing for student must notice is, there are so many YouTube videos that are available for telling about these strategies, planning and all. But student must uh, look into those videos which are given by experts yes. who have got a considerable expertise in this particular gate field uh, like us, like us, like you and me. Mm -hmm. Because I myself has got more than uh, 25 to 30 years of uh, gate coaching experience. Since 96, I have been in the gate field. Uh, you are there, you almost for more than 15, 10 to 15 years yes, you have been yes. there. So, whenever you are uh, planning a strategy or guidance from the expertise or YouTube videos, take those people or look into those videos which are given by the experts, gate experts. And as far as the strategy is concerned, see in the mechanical we have the three streams, thermal and fluid okay. and design and mechanics and we have the okay. production and industrial production. Okay. Three, stream, three, stream, three streams we can break up entire syllabus. Classify, uh, classify into three streams. And uh, marks also will come like that, 72 core marks. Mm -hmm. Generally, they will be given, each will be 25, 25, 25, uh, approximately this side, this way or that way, mostly. Okay. Um, but sometimes one stream may get more marks like mm -hmm. that. So, while preparing, there is a certain sequence you have to follow. Okay. So, for example, if you take the thermal and fluid senses, okay. unless otherwise uh, you prepare the fluid mechanics, we cannot understand the heat transfer. Okay. Because in the convection chapter of heat transfer, the kind of fundamentals of fluid mechanics are very much essential. Okay. So, that sequence you have to follow. First same, plate, same will be with the strength of material. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Same, same will be the second uh, stream. Unless otherwise you have got the strength of materials, we cannot understand the machine design. Yes, yes, uh, yes. And, and similarly, one more thing is that unless otherwise you have the engineering mechanics, mm -hmm. we cannot understand the theory of machines. Yes, so, yes, that yes. sequence you have to follow. Mm -hmm. So, begin with the either thermodynamics or fluid mechanics in the thermal stream. Begin with the either engineering mechanics or shanta materials in the mechanic stream. Whereas, the production is concerned, it is little bit independent. Okay. So, you have metal cutting and machine tools is there. That is not dependent on the casting. So, you have the in the production uh, engineering, uh, uh, there is a metal casting, metal casting, metal cutting and machine tools and metal casting, forming, welding. Mm -hmm. And uh, um, uh, in SIM, you will be there and uh, machine tool and uh, metrology and in inspection. Okay. So, many areas are there, but they are independent. Mm -hmm. They are not interdependent. Okay. Uh, so, uh, you, whenever you are while well preparing, where you get bored with one particular step, supposing you are preparing thermodynamics, you are getting bored. Immediately switch to the uh, some other stream like uh, uh, strength of materials, yes, yes. which is a very much analytical subject. Strength of materials weightage is around 8 to 10 marks in the gate. Mm -hmm. Very, very important some strength of materials or solid mechanics. So, uh, and certain areas are very important in that particular subject. Mm -hmm. Generally, the strategy means the strategy you may plan, you may get only by looking into the previous years. Previous course years, course years. Course. At least you have to look into the six to seven years uh, last previous years. Course. They are available in the website. Available also. The website. They are available in the website. Yes. So you can just download them and uh, look into them. Just you, you can't answer that. But keep reading them. Yes. So by reading them often you will come to know what are the areas most likely the questions are coming yes. and pinpoint those areas, yes, yes, pinpoint yes. those areas mm -hmm. and begin the and give more extra stress in those areas. Yes. Say for example, heat transfer is there. You will not find a generally a question paper, uh, a mechanical paper without the lump heat analysis or the uh, biot number. Yes. So, uh, that, that area we have to focus more so that uh, you, when the question comes in the examination very quickly your response time will be considerably reduced and we will be, our approach will be very faster and with a minimum time we can answer the question. Okay. So, that kind of a strategy we have to plan. Strategy in the sense, what, what is the sequence of preparation? Okay. What, uh, identifying those areas where the questions are repeatedly being asked 
and uh, questions will not be repeated, but the concept behind the question will be repeated. repeated. Mm. Yeah. That is true in the civil engineering yes, also, yes. but in your, in your branch also, I guess. Mm -hmm. Question will never be repeated, but the concept behind the question will be the same. Will be the same. So, that, that we have to catch up that concept so, and to practice the questions relevant to that concept that, in all the models. Mm -hmm. Those papers are available in the website. Mm -hmm. Practice them. So not all subjects are equally important. Ah, ah. Some are to be prioritized. Ah, ah, ah. So in within a subject also, not all topics ah, yeah, exactly, are equally important. Exactly. Not there not also you, ah, have to have to you have to pick up those parts. So I chapter. think students might be interested to get a more detailed ah. view on the... Ah, that I will give it for the exclusive for mechanical. I will give an entire detailed video later, uh, which will be comprising of two hours of video. I will be giving later. Mm -hmm. I'll be exclusively how to plan for the uh, exam and all. I'll give later there. Mm -hmm. But time being, I can say that look often into the previous year's papers, at least 78 years. Mm -hmm. So, also, some students have already contacted us. They mm -hmm. require something like a personalized strategy. Mm -hmm. So, uh, they are having some few questions, few mm -hmm. confusions, mm -hmm. and more students will be out there. Mm -hmm. So, they might be, uh, might require some uh, help and guidance from our side. Yeah, exactly. So, I think you can explain how they can contact uh, uh, you. Uh, how, yeah, how, yes, how, exactly. And actually, you know, from M Sigma Gokulam, we have developed uh, certain uh, WhatsApp groups, mechanical engineering community groups in our WhatsApp. We have got three to four groups are there. And uh, uh, we will be conducting some quizzes also there. I okay. will be personally posting some quizzes, relevant to the gate syllabus only. And uh, people will be answering those quizzes and I will be correcting them. I will be discussing about the groups. And, uh, and I, um, enter into the groups, uh, register in those groups. And you can, whatever the doubt you have, Anyway, it is open to all. It is not that only what we who have registered for the M Sigma. It is open to all. You can register into those WhatsApp groups and then you can get your doubts clear immediately. Within 24 hours, you will get your doubt will be cleared. We have an expert team in uh, mechanical uh, in all these streams and uh, those uh, people, expert people will be quickly answering those your doubts, whatever is relevant to during your preparation. That's actually a priceless opportunity because uh, uh, earlier times we, uh, we have, uh, the teachers won't be approachable, we won't be able to ask our doubts, uh, yeah, our yeah. doubts will be hidden and we won't be confident in interviews actually. Yeah, yeah. So to, you know, to ask doubts directly uh, uh, to such we, faculties uh, who are that we experienced. Have, we, have got we have developed a WhatsApp groups, you can directly, can't, you can call us also. We are welcome to call us. Actually, we are open to all, not only for our students, we're open to all. We can call us, we can post your doubts, immediately we will get the answers in those groups. Okay. So, yeah. students, kindly please use the opportunity. <laughs> so, that's a <laughs> priceless opportunity. Yeah. Okay. So, sir, regarding the second uh, paper mm. combination, yeah. I, I think you have gone through that. I, in the uh, website also, it's shown that mm. mechanical people can uh, attend one more gate mm. paper, which, is, uh, which could be aerospace or naval architecture and marine, mm. industrial uh, instrumentation engineering. Mm. Uh, industrial production, mm. so XE, um, uh, engineering, engineering sciences. Yes, yes, so yes. these are the various combinations which mm. gate, um, you know, uh, website suggest. Mm. So which one would be the ideal combination for yes, engineering? Yes, it's a very, good, very good question actually. Most of the mechanical students will be opting to write, apart from mechanical, they would be writing for also the production, production. industry, P&I paper they call okay, okay, okay. P&I paper, where the syllabus around 60% overlapping will be there. In the P&I paper, these thermal sciences and all will not be having much weightage, only few fundamentals they may ask. Most of the syllabus, two streams of the mechanical, like a manufacturing, uh, industrial and manufacturing, and the uh, design and mechanics, that those two domains will be common in both the streams, P&I and mechanical. Yes. So, mechanical students, I may advise to write the second paper as a P&I or you may choose the XE, Engineering Sciences. But in the Engineering Sciences, it is 15 marks mathematics, 15 marks aptitude. Whereas in our regular core, mm -hmm. it is 13 marks uh, mathematics, mathematics and 15 marks aptitude. aptitude. But there in the XE, it is 15 marks mathematics and 15, 15 marks, marks aptitude. Yeah. Everybody should write. Also, I think there is uh, strength of material. And, and there are six papers six will be papers there. Six to seven papers are there. So but out similar of, to the mechanical uh, But actually, three subjects are very close to our mechanical. Okay. One is thermodynamics. Second thing is fluid mechanics. Okay. Third thing is a solid mechanics, solid. which we call it as a strength of materials. materials. So, three subjects uh, match with the mechanical branch, core so, branch. Okay. So, out of the uh, three, you may choose two. But the main thing in the regarding the XE paper is the kind of question what they ask in the XE, mm -hmm. the type of question, the depth of the question they ask in the XE paper, say for example, fluid mechanics. The question, the type of question of FM in XE paper is entirely different and tougher, much, much tougher than the what the FM question what you see in the core mechanical. 
very 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 generally people will be tempted people will be tempted to take the xc as a lightly because they have already studied the fm and uh, thermodynamics in the core mechanical so they are, they are, that those two questions the subjects will be sufficient to get the good score in gate no don't go by that because unless you are very deeply go into the subject of the core uh, particularly say thermodynamics unless you are very strongly prepared because the type of questions asked in the xc paper will be very tough in thermodynamics. Okay. Similarly, fluid mechanics also. Because only two subjects, they want to check your uh, uh, engineering aptitude. Okay. So, when they are checking the engineering aptitude with only two subjects, thermodynamics and FM, how can they set the paper lightly? Mm -hmm. Here, in the core mechanical, he is testing around uh, 15 subjects. Yes, yes. There, he is testing only two subjects. How can you expect uh, the same kind of questions in XE? But um, is that a strategy? I think, I mean, students who are serious about writing XE paper, yeah. whether they are prepared, uh, giving more importance to these three subjects, uh -huh. so that will help them in the mechanical paper. Is that, that, that will help them, but uh, the time consumption will be very high. They, they very won't high. be able to cover ah, They won't, because in, in the mechanical, if you, if you put all your time in thermodynamics and fluid Thermodynamic. mechanics, and uh, some materials, where would you get the time to prepare the uh, manufacturing sciences and uh, industrial? Because in the industrial, we have the operation research, you have the inventory control, we have the production planning and control. So, the time management will be difficult. But what I suggest is, uh, prepare for the core mechanical. One more thing is there. If you prepare for the core mechanical mm -hmm. for the, the gate, you can write many other examinations. Soon we are expecting the ISRO for your information. ISRO, we are also giving coaching for the ISRO, Scientist C. Mm -hmm. Soon the notification may come in ISRO, Scientist C 2024. Also so, staff selection. So, uh, uh, that uh, Scientist C exam, uh, notification of the ISRO, ISRO exam uh, may come correct. soon. Yes, yes. The syllabus of gate of the and the syllabus of the ISRO are almost same. With okay. this gate preparation, you can easily attempt there. So, don't restrict yourself only to subject preparation by choosing the XE mm -hmm. and uh, then in that case only you will be writing only XE, you will not be preparing for the mechanical. mechanical. Okay. Just keep an option of XE as a, uh, as a supplementary, don't go only by the XE, prepare for the core mechanical only. When you prepare for the core mechanical gate, this syllabus preparation will be very much useful to write the ISRO or the BARC, BARC examination or the DRD, whatever the examination, because this syllabus… Even, uh, even in civil services, uh, we have the optional uh, paper uh, as mechanical. Optional paper as mechanical, mechanical and the syllabus will be the same. But the questions in the civil papers will be tougher than the gate mm -hmm. because they have the conventional paper, yes, much yes. tougher than the gate also. Mm -hmm. Also engineering services mm -hmm. and as far as the data science and artificial intelligence, there are no expert teachers there. The subjects are lesser, but where is the expert teachers there? So, uh, I suggest for the mechanicals, either P and I paper okay. or the XE they can choose. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, once if uh, they get through uh, successfully through mm -hmm. gate. Mm -hmm. So, what will be the best speci specializations that are available? Specializations, there are many options. Right now, what is the uh, Generally, yeah. generally nowadays, gen any any uh, good aspiration is thermal sciences or manufacturing or the machine design. Mm -hmm. In a good IIT, definitely uh, they, uh, they, they may get the campus interviews there okay. after uh, finishing the MTech in a good IIT there. Because, yeah. but to get into the good IIT, your score must be sufficiently high. Sufficiently high, your rank should be um, less than 1000 like that, in that 1000 or 800 in that range. Okay. And, uh, and you may, if you are lucky enough to uh, get a single digit or a double digit rank, you may enter even a PSU is there. Okay. Okay. So, recent trends show that the number of people attending, uh -huh. candidates attending the gate exam is getting uh, reduced. Uh, getting reduced, uh -huh. but uh, for the last two years, uh, uh, it is again increased. Mechanical increased. absorbed in the last two years, uh, okay. it is, in, it, there was a decline, but again started again increasing, picking increasing, up. picking up in a mechanical. Okay, okay. Mechanical, core mechanical. Okay. So, much opportunities are awaiting the students. Yeah. Mechanical, okay. plenty of opportunities. Uh, gate is one single answer for many uh, many questions. Giving a gate and preparing a thoroughly preparing for the gate and giving the gate is a single answer for so many questions. Once for all, your career will be set if you get a good score in the gate. Okay. So, as a concluding statement, and, uh, and concluding uh, one, one thing is preparation strategy must contain preparing a short notes, giving the more and more number of tests. Monthly minimum three tests you have to give as such. So by giving the more and more tests, your response time in the examination will be considerably reduced. Yes, yes. You will be able to answer more number of questions in, in, a, in those three, three, three hours. Because you know, the reading the question, understanding the question and solving the question, all that response time, combined time will be considerably reduced if you practice and if you more and more problems, if you practice them, if you give the more and more tests. By rating the tests, you will be finding your own weaknesses, which point you are weak, 
which point you are strong. Those weak points, weak syllabus or weak points, you can plug by writing the test. Because by writing, what is the test? Giving a test, you will be knowing how, how strong you are in yes, that yes. particular subject. You can subject identify that. the weakness. Yeah, identify, identifying the weakness. So, that weakness can be plugged up uh, if you write the more and more tests. So, that that uh, that particular question again if comes in the uh, gate examination similar question you would be able to quickly answer with a more accuracy so the key so point in preparation that's is actually preparation writing, strategy, very important writing thing is that a series writing, and the second thing is uh, writing a preparing a, sh a short notes short notes will terrifically uh, be benefit the uh, student bear because entire thermodynamics or entire heat transfer you can write in uh, three or four pages or yes. maximum five pages yes. just five pages you can write a short notes very important salient points salient formula uh, so, the, even after gate, that will be very useful. Very much useful. Even be after that, because whenever they, any other exam, like ASRO, ASRO or, ASRO, or, I mean, or a BARC examination, they have there, right? This exam, in, this. For interviews as well. Interviews as well. Very much interviews. Because even in the ASRO, only 50% uh, marks weightage go to the exam and 50% for the interviews. interviews. In the ASRO, scientists see, which is a national level examination. Okay, we are giving coaching for the ASR also for information. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh -huh. so M Sigma Google is uh, uh, yeah. and download very, the app and all the information you may get yes. by downloading our M Sigma Google map mm -hmm. and uh, uh, all the MC mechanical uh, WhatsApp community groups to clarify your doubts. Anybody, it is open to all, not only our uh, M Sigma students. You can easily get those numbers, register, join those groups, and try to interact with the faculty. You will get a, a, a lot of information and a lot of uh, concept, uh, in depth concepts in the, by joining those uh, WhatsApp groups. So, they can join us uh -huh. uh, as a part of our course or they can even come to the uh, uh, WhatsApp uh, groups, they can ask doubts. And you can call us also, above all you can so call, our numbers are available in the WhatsApp, M Sigma Google map, download the app and uh, all the information you will get. So, it could be an amazing journey if mm. you can join us. Mm. So, much opportunities are waiting you. So, in case of any doubts regarding your mechanical engineering gate preparation, you can always contact uh, Sagar sir. Mm -hmm. So, uh, as I have told, this he is the best in uh, our country and you, are you will be lucky to have him. So, I think we can conclude the podcast. We will be uh, coming up with more interesting videos, more informative videos. Mm -hmm. And he will be conducting a sole uh, session for uh, in detail. The, in, in detail, the, the, the video the I give it, uh, preparation strategy exclusively for the mechanical containing our one and a half hour video. I will give it uh, in within few days. Okay. So, please stay in touch. Mm. For now, we can mm. bid adieu, I think. Thank you. Bye. Thank okay. you, Charlie.